all the freaking packages. I'll definitely be wearing this. The odorant like stains on it already. And this is what the Telfar beanie looks like. It's just, ooh, they look really good. Don't Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel if you're new here. My name's Sam. Welcome to the Sam Fam. Wow, it's been it's been a time. I haven't been on here in a minute, but you guys already know the deal. I don't know what I've been on lately, but it's just not been on YouTube. That's where I haven't been. Um, my camera quality looks different because I'm filming on my phone because I thought I was charging my freaking camera all day yesterday, but it didn't charge at all. So. That's where we're at, and also I'm bald in the eyes because I took off my lashes because they were just like, literally like spiders on my eyes. This is how my eyes looked when I sat down. I was like, I can't do it. Anyways, as you guys can see from the title today, I am doing an unboxing video, but before we get started into that, please do me a favor and hit the subscribe button down below. Turn the post notification bell on because I plan to upload, so I want you guys to get notified when I do, since I've been off the grid. I know YouTube's not gonna inform you like they used to. Um, and yeah, follow me on Instagram, TikTok. I post over there way more often than I post here, and that's my fault, but um, I will have them both right here on the screen so that you guys can check me out there. Um, but yeah, I'm like literally in my work outfit and about to go to work, but I wanted to, where did I put my bag open? I need to go grab that. But I wanted to unbox all these items that I have here um, before because first of all, they're going in my suitcase because I'm leaving to Sacramento tonight. And two, um, they've just been sitting here collecting dust. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so here's all the freaking packages. <laughs> oh my God. We're gonna start small. So this first package I have is from Made in Sack, or maybe it's just called Made. No, it's Made in Sack, Made in Sack. Um, this is a, it's not local because I'm not home. I don't live at, back at home, but it's a brand in Sacramento. My friend Jolene put me onto them. I think Maya told me about them too. I might have something from them already. I think my Sacramento shirt that I have is from them. Anyways, I got this beanie. I love the royal blue color. It's really, really pretty. And it says Made in Sack. Um, and then it has the 916, which is the Sacramento area code. Um, but instead of a one, it has the tree because Sacramento is the city of trees. Um, and then it has, oh, that's cute. I think their logo is like the Sac Bridge, the Golden Bridge. But yeah, this is really cute. I'll definitely be wearing this while I'm back home. I might even wear it to the snow because I am going to the snow um, in Boreal when I'm back home. So this is the first item I opened. The first, this is the first item, so really cute, love that. I'm gonna have all the links to all the items that I purchased down below. This, I actually like just follow them on Instagram and DM the guy to purchase, so I'll just put their Instagram down below for that. The next package I have is from Pretty Little Thing, and it's actually already open because, because the thieves are out. The thieves are out, and they opened my package, but apparently what was inside wasn't good enough for them to take. Um, because I also opened the actual like packaging in here too. So they said, mm, nah, we ain't gonna take her little pretty little thing package. We don't, we gonna let her slide today. But thankfully they did because it's the uh, shirt I plan on wearing on Thanksgiving. So I got this corset top from Pretty Little Thing. And this is what it looks like. Hopefully it fits, I think it will. And then it has like the long sleeves. I'm not trying anything on, but just follow me on my social media because I'm probably gonna do a get ready with me for Thanksgiving on TikTok. Why it has like deodorant like stains on it already is beyond me. Pretty little thing. Like what are you guys doing? What's happening? That's annoying. But anyways, it's this corset. 
I'll put a little picture right here of like the model when she was wearing it. Um, it looks cute. I'm disappointed that it already has like deodorant stains on it, which gives me the vibe that somebody probably tried this on already. But anyways, here it is in all her glory. I got a size, does it show me the size here? It does not. UK 18, but I think it was a US 14 or 12. I can't remember. So that's that. Oh, I think this is another beanie, actually. From Telfizi. Yes, it is. Okay. So I got a Telfar beanie. Let's open it for you guys. This is what the Telfar beanie looks like. It's just black with the little Telfar emblem. This is the beanie I was originally planning on wearing to the snow. Oh, I like it, it's cute. I love this. Oh my God, it's so cute. Yeah, we're gonna have to decide between the two, but either way, both of them are gonna get worn. <laughs> um, but I really like this beanie, it's cute. Telfizi. Um, okay. Ooh, this is an exciting box. So I've never ordered from this store before, but I've been looking for boots similar to the Balenciaga, like biker boots with the straps and the studs on them um, because your girl's not spending a Balenciaga coin, but she wants the Balenciaga look. Um, and so therefore I found these, I think the brand is named Milanu. Uh, like I said, I'll have it linked down below. Oh my God, I'm excited. These are the boots. Ooh, they look really good. Here they are. The leather doesn't look as like plasticky in person, I would say. I think the light reflecting from my ring light is making it look more like that. But yeah, these are the boots. Oh my God. Okay, I gotta try one of them on. Wow. These are my Thanksgiving boots if they fit right. <clears throat> I got a size 10 because that was the largest size they had. I mean, I wear a size 10 regardless, but sometimes I like to get an 11 because my foot is fat. But let's see. Let's see if this works. Ah, I think it works. <gasps> oh my goodness. They're bad. And they might be deceiving me right now, but they feel comfy. Oh my God. Can we all see them in all their glory? Super cute. Super cute. I'm in love. And they have this really like soft lining in them on the inside. So they're gonna keep you warm and cozy. Love that for me. Oh my God, these boots are fire. Fire. And they were only like 80 bucks, y'all. Ooh, wait, I love that. Okay, that just made me really happy <laughs> because I was really hoping and wishing that one, they would come in time, and two, that um, they would fit. So all those things happened, and I'm so happy. I forgot what this is. <gasps> ah, I forgot, my stupid ass. <laughs> Okay, so I got this off of Depop, and it is a vintage leather cowboy's jacket. Oh my god, they gave me like stickers or something in here. Let me see what they gave me. <laughs> Look at this, some Simpson stickers. That's funny. But they gave me some Simpson stickers, that's cute. Shout out to this guy because he was very responsive and sent my package quickly. So this has been sitting here for a while. Oh my God, it looks so good. Okay, so this is my vintage leather cowboy's jacket. This is the, um, what is his name? Carl, uh, Carl Banks. I guess he had a brand back in the day. Um, and so he made NFL jackets. He was an NFL player. Oh my God, it has like the shoulder pads. It's extra heavy. Let me try this on. 
This is also a part of my Thanksgiving Day look. Oh, fuck. I love it, I love it, I love it. This is so, you know, pretty good condition considering how old this jacket is. Um, it's really good, I'm happy. I'm excited. This jacket did cost a pretty penny. Not like super crazy expensive, it was listed at 180, then it went on sale for 160, and then I offered 140, and then you know, plus shipping and handling and stuff, so it came to about 160 for this jacket. But Dallas! <laughs> if you know, you know I'm a Dallas fan. Last year I even went to the Dallas game uh, for Thanksgiving out in Dallas, so that was really fun. But anyway, is our last package, and it's from Ego. So that means more shoes, even though Ego does sell clothes, but I've never bought any clothes from them before. So this is a shoe purchase. So originally I was gonna wear the shoes, one of the pairs of shoes that I got from Ego for Thanksgiving, but then I found the shoes that you guys just saw. Which I'm so happy I found because that's more the look I wanted anyway. Oh my God, this package is quite the shoe was open. Ugh. All right, so the first box is dusty as hell and beat the fuck up. <laughs> okay. All right, so these are not the ones that I was gonna possibly wear for Thanksgiving, but these are just another pair of boots that they had, like, they were on sale for like 25 bucks. You know, kind of like the Balenciaga look. It's like the knitted material, soft-like material, and then the rubber bottom. I just thought these were really cute and perfect for the season, the fall, winter season. Um, so yeah, I got these. Super cute. Oh, oh, oh. This package was dusty dirty. Wow. And then I got another pair of boots. I've honestly been eyeing these boots for a long time and then they went on sale, so. How to, how to purchase, how to come. Ooh, these are bad. Damn. I mean, I'm wearing the other ones for Thanksgiving, but these are bad as fuck too. Like, look at the detail on them. Oh, love these. They have them in the opposite colorway, so like the black with the white detailing as well. Let me try these on too. I don't know why I didn't try the green boots on, but I will eventually. Oh. <laughs> Here they are on. They have a similar um, lining inside of them too. I got these in a size 10 as well, so. Really cute. I'm excited. But yeah, that is all the packages. I actually was expecting one more package. I had a skirt that I was supposed to be coming in the mail that I was also supposed to be wearing on Thanksgiving, but it never came, so that's unfortunate. Honestly, the skirt was a really short skirt anyway, so probably best that it didn't come because I don't think that would have been, would have been an appropriate item to wear um, for Thanksgiving, but yeah, I'm like out of breath. That's it, that is all. Those are all the items that I got. I'm so excited for everything that came in, like, Super excited. Um, obviously, I think you guys could tell my favorite item are these boots. Ooh, I love them. Um, but yeah, if you guys wanna check out any of the items that I got, check the links down below in the description box. I will have everything that I purchased. Obviously, like the vintage jacket, I'm not gonna have that specific, you know what I mean? Like, it's gonna be a different jacket because <laughs> Um, somebody else is gonna be selling it. Obviously the guy sold that one and it's gone now, it's mine. Um, but yeah, everything else will be linked down below. Um, if you guys have any questions, let me know. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Like I said, follow me on Instagram and on TikTok so you guys can keep up with me, see more of like my daily content. I'm thinking about doing Vlogmas this year, so y'all let me know what y'all think if I should or if I shouldn't. Um, but yeah, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I miss y'all. I love y'all. Thank you, Sam Fam, for rocking with me still. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Yeah, yeah.